Yes. So, so it is somewhat problematic, although using a VPN oh. is something that I've advised every British citizen. No, and in fact, not just anyone not. who can really afford it at this stage. Yep. It's something that I think should become a little bit more standard in terms of internet use. I think, you know, these are companies that should be white, you know, Sort of Reaper should Act. receive widespread support from us. Evolution um, of the phone hacking service. scandal um, by and News also International. As well, it is not go this is not going to be the first time this happens. This is not going to be restricted entirely to the UK. How now, certain so bodies stop so, you uh, yeah, get familiar with VPNs, um, accessing um, your security cameras so while you're away from your home um, while again, something's being done below. inside That's, your home. Um, that covers a lot, you know, in a little bit more detail, some of the aspects to it. This is, again, this is the hacking power, where it, um... From actually reading it myself from the government website, certain bodies can, for whatever reason, place actors around you, i.e. move them in next door, um, to create situations to either section, imprison, or if deemed a threat to those that have the Reaper Act, um, they can actually target you for death. How would they do that? By messing with your food? Poison you? It's got to be something discreet, hasn't it? Yeah? But first they got to make out you're mad so, they, so no one listens to you. Or set up a situation where they um, entrap you into using violence to protect yourself. To say, oh, he's violent. Yeah. Oh. Go look up um, the UK government website with the codes of use for Reaper and you'll see it with your own eyes and then you'll know I'm telling the truth about it. Okay? 